here let us see a question from the topic combinations question is if n plus 1 c r plus 1 is 2 n c r is 2 n minus 1 c r minus 1 is equal to 11 is to 6 is to 3 then find the value of n and r ok so let us do this question and for this question we must recall the formula which we have already studied previously that n c r is equal to n factorial by r factorial n minus r whole factorial. So let us use this formula for solving this question. So first of all let us take this part from left side and this part from right side. So n plus 1 c r plus 1 is to n c r is equal to 11 is to 6. Okay. Now by applying this formula let us expand it. So this is n plus 1 whole factorial by r plus 1 whole factorial into n plus 1 minus r minus 1 whole factorial n minus r factorial ok. So in place of n here we are having n plus 1 in place of r we are having r plus 1. So we can do like this is to here n factorial by r factorial n minus r whole factorial this is equal to 11 by 6 correct or let us simplify it further this is n plus 1 whole factorial by r plus 1 whole factorial here plus 1 minus 1 will be cancel out so this is n minus r whole factorial okay and we will try to convert this ratio sign into multiplication so this numerator will come in the denominator here n factorial and in numerator we are getting r factorial and n minus r whole factorial is equal to 11 by 6. You see n minus r factorial will be cancelled out from numerator and denominator ok or we will try to cancel this n factor factorial with n plus 1 factorial. So this n plus 1 factorial is n plus 1 into n factorial similarly this r plus 1 factorial will be cancelled with this r factorial so we will expand it like this r plus 1 into r factorial into r factorial by n factorial this is equal to 11 by 6 ok so r factorial will be cancelled out as well as this n factorial will be cancelled out and by cross multiplication we are getting 6n plus 6, 6n plus 6 is equal to 11r plus 11, 11r plus 11 or we can write here 6n minus 11r, 6n minus 11r and this 11 will be transposed to left side so 6 minus 11 is minus 5 this is equal to 0, this is relation number 1. Next. Similarly, we are taking this ratio n c r is to n minus 1 c r minus 1 is equal to 6 by 3. Now we are taking this last two parts here in left hand side and last two parts from right hand side. Okay. Now we will expand it. So here n c r can be written as n factorial by r factorial n minus r whole factorial and this ratio sign will be converted into multiplication sign. So this n minus 1 whole factorial in numerator will be written in denominator now n minus 1 whole factorial and here in numerator we will write r minus 1 whole factorial into n minus 1 into r minus 1 means n minus r whole factorial this is equal to 6 by 3 and this is equal to 2 ok so n minus r will be cancel out or similarly here yeah, this n minus 1 factorial will be cancel out with this n factorial so it will remain n here and r minus 1 factorial will be cancel out with r factorial so we will write here r is equal to 2 or n is equal to 2r we are getting this value so therefore 
by relation 1 if you put n is equal to 2r in relation 1 then this will be 2r so 6 into 2r means 12r minus 11r is equal to 5 or r is equal to 5 r is equal to 5 so therefore n is 2 into r r is 5 so 2 into 5 means n is equal to 10 so this is the answer r is equal to 5 n is equal to 10 understood very interesting very simple question wish you all the best